What's going on everybody? It's your boy Ace from Red Clothing. And today we're going to do the fit test, the wash test, the after the wash fit test for the original favorite blanks that I reviewed in my previous video. So do me a favor before we get into it, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and please drop a comment for your boy and let me know what it is that you want to see in the videos in the future. If there's anything that I could do for you, you know I'm going to make it happen. Let's get into it. So this is the size large in the black organic pullover hoodie. You know, as you can see, it's a little snug. I would say definitely size up in these. I'm a size large in a bunch of different brands, um, but this one right here is pretty snug. The sleeves are a little short. I do like the fit on the size, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't stay true to size on the hoodies, the pullover hoodies. I definitely wouldn't. But this is how it looks, size large. Definitely wouldn't. You see the sleeves is a little, you know what I'm saying? Let me get a little closer. This is just me, you know what I'm saying? Just being loose and love up. Yeah. Size large is not it for the hoodies, eh? This is the Supima Cotton t shirt. Um, I like it. A little bit snug, but not too bad. Like, I could definitely wear this in the summertime and not feel, you know, it's too tight on me. I would probably size up the next time I order just to make sure that, you know what I'm saying, I'm giving myself a little bit of breathing room. And also, I gotta wash it first, because if it shrinks, it's definitely gonna be too small, you would need to size up. So, I like it. This is the large and the Supremo Cotton T-shirt. Y'all see? You know, and they got the side seams are pretty good. I like the fit, you know what I'm saying? Close up on the, on the arms. The collar is really good. So yeah, man. It's a nice shirt. It feels so good on the skin. I just don't know how it's going to feel after the wash or how it's going to fit after the wash. We're going to find out and do this shit all over again. This is the Cotton Crew Neck sweatshirt. Um, I like it fit-wise. Um, it's true to size for the most part. The sleeves is just a little bit, you know what I'm saying, a little short. I guess that's an issue across the entire brand. Um, the sleeves is just a little short, so you might want to size up, but just keep in mind that if you do size up, this is just gonna be a lot more loose. Um, but this is how it looks so far. This is a size large. I like it. Um, probably, I'll probably stay true to size with this one just because I don't want it to be too wide. The sleeves, I'll compromise for the sleeve, but I probably wouldn't wear this anyway. Uh, so, you know, you, this is something that you got to determine how you like it, how it fits. I'm six feet, 220 pounds. These sleeves are not it for me. So, there's that. Now, this is the zipper putty. This fits true to size. Sleeves is good. You see, ain't no pullback on the sleeves. The side seams, it feels real good. Heavyweight. Yeah. This is the one that you might have to stay true to size and I like this one a lot in terms of the fit. Um, I got no complaints about this one yet. So hopefully it stays the same after we wash it, but we gonna find out. See the sleeves? Very good. These side seams. I love this right here. I don't know if you can see that. The ribbing. It's amazing. Has it on all the sweatshirts, so it's pretty cool. Now I'm gonna do the sweatpants. So these are the sweatpants. I like to fit a lot. Super comfortable. Take the true size. This is the size that I would stick with. Hopefully after the wash, feels the same, looks the same. But these are actually perfect. And these are size large. So here we are back from the wash and dry test. And just up for the first glance, I feel like some of the items might have shrunk, um, especially the black hoodie. It was already small, but it looked a little smaller. I mean, that's what's gonna happen with, you know, 100% uh, cotton garments. The only thing that, you know, is bothering me is the fact that on their website, it says that this pre-shrunk already to minimize, you know what I'm saying? Shrinking or whatever. But it's only one way to find out, man. 
We'll do the flip test. Let's do it. <laughs> I ain't even gonna hold you, this is crazy. <laughs> yeah, this is bad. This is really bad shrinking. Oh, um, shrinkage. But you know, the reason I do this, these are test garments anyway. Um, but the reason I do this is because there's a lot of people that's not gonna follow the wash uh, directions correctly. So um, I do this. I always do a um, wash and dry test on all the garments that I buy beforehand because I want to send it to the consumer and let them know what they can and cannot dry. You know what I'm saying? So there's certain things that you can wash and dry, certain things you can't. This is obviously not one of those things that you can dry. This is something that you can't. Extremely little. This looks like a size small, honestly. It was already snug to begin with. This is terrible, bro. Like. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad. This is the Supreme Khan shirt. It was already a little bit snug to begin with. It's definitely small, shrunk as well. It, it feels, you know, it still feels nice. I like it, but you know, this is very small. I probably wouldn't even wear this outside after I wash and dry it. This is probably something that I'm not gonna implement on my brand. Or for the fact that I like to, you know, use garments that once you dry them, if you dry them by mistake, it's not, it's gonna ensure that there's minimal shrinkage. You know, this is something that their website said that it's pre shrunk or something like that. So, this, I don't know how to feel about it. Probably not gonna use it though. Let's see what's next. Again, another one. The sleeves is already small. This is tiny now. You know, shrinkage is crazy on these garments. But that's because they are 100% cotton. Just take it from me. Don't, you know, if you're gonna buy this brand, do not dry your clothing. You know what I'm saying? I dry it on medium heat. Um, that's what I do with most of my stuff anyway. But I figured, let me do this with this. Average person, you know, they dry their clothing anyway. So this is, take it from me. Look, sleeves is crazy. <laughs> I can't even move in this, this is bugged out. And it's probably gonna be a constant pattern with everything. Don't wanna try the sweatpants on, but hoodies, everything else. This was, the, the sleeves was good on this before, you know what I'm saying, I, I, I washed it and dried it. This is bad, you know what I mean? Like, nobody wants to walk around with a hoodie and the sleeves is all snug up. Now, I, I'm not bashing original favorites neither. It's just that when you're dealing with 100% cotton garments, this is what happens when you wash and dry them. If you have something that's like a 50-50 blend, minimal shrinkage. But again, my thing is their website says pre-shrunk. This is not pre-shrunk. This is, there's, there's a lot of, you know what I'm saying? There's a huge difference. Oh. Uh, so my final verdict with original favorites is before the clothes is washed and dry, the clothes look amazing. Um, but afterwards, not so much. My thing with them is that their website says it's pre-shrunk. I feel like that's a bit misleading because that's a huge difference. The black large hoodie was already small. It fit me like a medium after washing and drying. Feels like a like a small, you know what I'm saying? That's not good to me. Even the Supreme Kind t-shirt, you know what I'm saying? Like I like to compare those to the Uniglow ones. And the Uniglow ones a couple years ago were amazing. I thought that this was gonna be something like that. I thought this was gonna be the one to replace that, but unfortunately. This is not it. And I'm not bashing any brand, but when you say on your website that it's pre-shrunk and then it shows that much extra shrinkage afterwards, I feel like that's that's very misleading, you know what I'm saying? So for anybody that's watching this and wants to, you know, dabble into original favorites, you might want to get yourself a sample box first before buying products in bulk, because that's you're gonna you're gonna lose out. Take it from me, bro. And all I did was wash it on medium, you know what I'm saying? I dried it on medium. Um yeah, so that's my take on original favorites. You know what I'm saying? Maybe this is something that they'll see. Maybe, you know what I mean? I could get in touch with them and um, just figure something out. I mean, they've been in the business long enough. But this is also what happens when you deal with 100% cotton garments. There's always going to be some shrinkage. My thing is that they, on their website, labeled it as pre-shrunk already. So, you know what I mean? That The variation afterwards is, is way more than an inch or half an inch or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Sleeves damn near was up here, so. It's not cool, but what we wanna do, this is the game, right? You gotta do these test runs. You gotta do all of this so that you can see exactly what it is that you wanna sell. Because if it's something that you wouldn't wear, why would you sell that, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna put that in my brand if it's something that I wouldn't wear myself afterwards. If I'm not happy with the, with the wash test and all that, why would I sell that to my customers, you know what I'm saying? So 
take it, learn from it, and uh, yeah, see y'all in the next video. But before you go, man, please hit that like button, subscribe, comment. Let me know what it is that you want to see in the next video. If there's any other blanks that you want me to test, I will be coming out with the top five Blank Streetwear t-shirts. That's coming up in the next couple of weeks. And uh, yeah, can't wait to see y'all in the next video. Peace. I couldn't even put the sweatpants on. Like, I'm trying to put them, you know what I'm saying? I'm over here, uh, uh, struggling. And I couldn't even put them things on. Um, hold on. Yeah. They're short. They're a lot shorter than they were. I could probably fit them in this whole thing. Yeah. A lot shorter than they were.